When you switch sides to face the wall, yeah, you know they're there. They're always there. They're always watching. <laughs> What in the world is going on, folks? Welcome back to MK. I'm your host, Robin, the blonde one, I guess? And today we're gonna be taking a look at r slash me IRL. What's a good age to have kids? Financially stable years old? Certainly wish more people realized that. Me, coming up on the thrilling conclusion to my dream storyline. My alarm. You guys sometimes get close to finishing your dreams? I never have. Although, I have experienced waking up from the dream, falling back to sleep and continuing from where I left off. Now that was incredible. Girls wearing metal band merch, 36 year old dude, name three songs. In my experience, the dude busts through the wall to say some sort of inappropriate sexual comment, but sure. Am I really hungry or do I want to eat just because I'm bored? Hey, hey, I'm really tired of getting photos of me in these posts, all right? Boredom gave me at least 20 extra pounds. I'm bored. You should get a hobby, all right? Fine, I'm bored. <laughs> there might be some deeper issues that you should be looking into if clients Climbing to the top of Mount Everest is boring for you. But hey, congrats, you didn't die on the way up. Now you just gotta get down. Calling me should be a felony. It is such a violent attack on my vibe. Look, it needs to be checked every now and then, Slate. When your cheat meal turns into a six month long snack sedent. <laughs> Why are there so many photos of me in here? But real quick, let's talk about that eye funny watermark, huh? No one, eight year old me. We just wanted to look cool, okay? Leave me alone. Allow me to slip into something more comfortable. Gets in my car and leaves. Oh, oh, I feel that so hard, it hurts. When I leave work, I'm gonna hit the gym, fold the laundry, get some cleaning done, and cook food. Me for four hours after getting home? You can't kid yourself like that. You can't. You've been working all day. What did you expect? The night before a day off is way more satisfying than the actual day off. Isn't it amazing how just knowing that you don't have to slave away the entire day the following morning can really just relieve stress? Like, to an extreme extent, you don't feel like you're gonna die? It's almost like the amount of time that we work genuinely needs to be re-looked at because damn, this ain't working. This boy is possessed by a demon that makes him unable to study. Upon exposure to books or anything related to school, he immediately passes out. Uh-huh, nice. We're studying geography. Now what state do you live in? Denial. <sighs> I don't suppose I can argue with that. Oh, Calvin. Dentist. When I poke the most tender part of your mouth with a sharp instrument, it bleeds, and that's your fault. Me, I am so sorry. And it does always seem a little bit weird, doesn't it? But hey, they're right. Pros and cons of existing. Pros. Dogs. Cons. Everything else. Mm, I don't know. You're so quiet. What's on your mind? Me. Fake scenarios. Like being happy. Don't y'all blow on food when it's hot, or do you have to huff, 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 huff till you can chew it? I blow on it, but underestimate how hot it is and have I said anyway. Man, I wish I was more like that guy, but he probably wishes he was more like somebody else too. Holy shit, I'm glad I'm me. Especially glad I'm not that guy. I am 100% convinced that every human being around me thinks this about me at all times. <laughs> goth girl yelling at me. Me secretly turned on. Why is there a goth girl yelling at you though? I need more context to the situation. When your friends finally persuade you to go to the gym and you're at the counter like... <laughs> It's kind of like me the first time I went rock climbing. Y'all ever look at old pictures of yourself and think, damn, people really let me walk around like that. But then you look in the mirror and think, damn, it's happening again. You need better friends. But before we get going any farther, today's video is sponsored by Keeps. Now, if we're talking statistics, two out of three men are going to experience some form of male pattern baldness by the time they turn 35, just like me. No, I'm not 35. Trust me, it may not look like it, but it is thinner up there than my patience for my roommates when they refuse to take out the recycling even though it's full and they were the last ones to find it. Now, the best way to prevent hair loss in general is to do something about it while you still have some hair on your head. And that's where Keeps comes in. It's become pretty revolutionary to help guys keep more of their hair for longer. Hence the name. Keeps, get it? You get it. You understand. Yeah, that's funny. Now, the best and most convenient part about Keeps, in my opinion, is the ability to get treated right from the comfort of your own home. 
The medication is delivered every three months to your doorstep, so there's no need to go out to Walmart and get judged by that 16-year-old cashier who, let's be honest, is not far behind you in terms of needing that treatment, now is he? Again, just remember, prevention is key here. Funny. It's the most important part, so the sooner you start, the better your results are going to be. So head on over to keeps.com slash MK. That's keeps.com slash E-M-K-A-Y, or click the link at the top of the description down below for 50% off your first order. I would of course again like to thank Keeps for sponsoring today's episode of MK. And without much further ado, Let's get back into the meme, shall we? When someone tries to get to know me, we are open. The door is just very heavy. Hey, you gotta give people fair warning, you know? My first instinct when I see an animal is to say hello. My first instinct when I see a person is to avoid eye contact and hope it goes away. Yeah, everybody else thinks that too, so it usually ends up working out that exact way. I want to make an infomercial where it's not clear what the guy is selling. Like he's demonstrating how powerful this vacuum is by sucking up a bowling ball, but then he starts showing you how strong the bowling ball is by dropping it on some knives. But then he's showing how the knives haven't been damaged at all by using them to cut through some shoes, and it goes on and on for two hours. And then it just loops back to the start while the number flashes on the screen the whole time, and if you call it, it just echoes whatever you say back to you. What kind of Black Mirror Twilight Zone bullcrap is this? Me picking my college major? Me picking a new jacket for spring? Well, to be fair, you're buying online, you've got to do a lot of research, otherwise you'll just end up returning it 700 times until you find one that fits. And the way we structure college is a freaking joke. In seventh grade, a boy asked me to be his girlfriend, and I wasn't sure I heard him correctly, so I panicked and just said, yes. And then he high-fived me and we never spoke again. Jamal, if you're out there, happy 11-year anniversary. Men over 30 in skinny jeans. It won't be me. It won't be me. When the teacher asks if you have any questions but you sit there in silence because you don't even know what you don't even know. That and if we're being honest, nine times out of ten, the question I have is probably stupid and going to make me look like an idiot, so I'm not gonna ask it at all anyway. One night stands, but instead of having sex, I just come over, eat all the food in your fridge, and leave. Wow, that's a topical idea, Katie. Look, I'm sorry, if you're gonna come over to my house and eat all of my food, I better be getting something out of it. Can you at least bring me over a beer or something? You wake up, you're a lizard, sunning on a red rock. It was all a dream. The concept of selling feet pics to pay back student loans is already losing its meaning. As you open and lick your own eyeballs to moisten them, time to eat a bug. Look, a man can dream, all right? The guy who picked on me in high school and then became a millionaire just came into KFC and I overcooked his chicken. Check Checkmate, Justin, you frickin' loser. Yeah, I know it's a joke, but if it was even remotely real, it's one of the saddest things I've ever seen. Intergalactic Marvel villains when they come to invade Earth, I go to America, the only country UFOs ever seem to land in. Bojangles Cashier, the lady in front of you paid for your meal. They've been doing a chain and paying for the person's meals behind them. Me? Oh, that's sweet. Might as well keep the chain going. What's the price for the people behind me? Oh, that family's order came to $27.73. Oh, well, here here is the $8 my meal was going to be. Take it off of their dinner. <laughs> I've only been a part of those chains once, and uh, luckily the guy behind me only ordered a 99 cent taco, so I lucked out on that one. How has serving impacted you? My wife screwed 10 guys while I was gone, and I'm afraid of fireworks. Happy Independence Day, hero! People who treat their birthday as a normal day think that they're more matured than everyone. We're just miserable, dude. Leave us alone. When you Google the lyrics of a song and realize you've been singing non nonsense for six months. Sometimes I'll Google the lyrics anyway and still sing nonsense. You ever sang along to a Nirvana song? Even if you know the lyrics, you can't really know the lyrics. After a couple of slices of pizza, my three-year-old bursts into tears and says, my mouth wants more, but my tummy doesn't. I've never related to anything more, nor will you ever again. Does your stomach ever hurt so bad that you get completely naked on the toilet? Yeah, oh yeah. You do it as a precautionary measure, just in case you explode you don't want to get it all over your clothes. You ever get bored, go to Netflix, but decide you're not ready for that kind of commitment right now, so you end up watching YouTube instead? Wow. Straight after job interview, I thought I was okay. Five minutes later, was okay I forgot to say a few things. Twenty minutes later, I didn't even mention anything I practiced. One hour later, that was probably the worst interview in the history of interviews. The next day, hey, still want to work here, buddy? They don't care. I want to be hot enough to make people question their sexual orientation. Well, I'm ugly enough to make people question their sexual orientation. Same, dude. Picasso died in 1973. No one freaking talked to me. I thought this man lived in 1500. 
Yeah, I always forget just how recently he was alive. I had a tiny, tiny blocked pour that nobody but me could possibly notice. But don't worry, guys. I screwed with it for 20 minutes, and now it's a massive welt of raw skin that everyone will definitely notice. I got this. Battery power is critically low. Guess I better go to sleep. Power saving mode activated. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. You can't outrun your problems, but you can jog slightly in front of them and pretend you can't hear them because you have your headphones on. What in the hell makes you think I can jog, especially long enough to keep my problems at bay? Plagiarism? Girl, I found your whole lesson plan on Quizlet. Ooh. <laughs> my rat costume finally showed up. What does it look like? A rat. Thanks. I just found out that people who suffer from anxiety tend to rewatch the same TV shows all over again because we already know what's going to happen next. Therefore, it creates a sense of safety and comfort, and that's the reason why we keep rewatching them. Shut up. I would have just stayed in the nutsack if I knew it was gonna be like this. I think most of us would have, but that's not for us to decide, Lewis. All you have to do is decide what to do with the time that is given to you. I just can't. Same. Yeah, same, man. It's so weird people are still asking, what are you up to? Like, obviously I'm home with my best friends, the screens. The reason I like staying up late so much is because between the hours of 1 and 5 a.m., the world is quiet and no one expects anything from me. I could literally stare at a wall for four hours with no consequences. I love the silence and calm. I love it. Doctors describe his condition as stable, but homosexual. Me? How bad is it, Doc? Give it to me straight. I I'm afraid I can't do that. Okay, I'ma start studying. Damn, it's only 117. I'll wait till 130. And thus the goalposts never stopped moving. Sucks how every girl I'm interested in is either taken or has good taste in men. It is an awful curse, isn't it? Dude, if you already know how much I'm supposed to pay for my taxes, just tell me. No, fine. Then I'm just gonna pay you whatever I think is fair. Okay, but then you're gonna go to jail, LMAO. <laughs> As a therapist, I can say confidently that while therapy is helpful, what most people really need is money. Believe you me, getting those emotions sorted out is one thing, but not having to constantly stress over when you'll be able to f***ing eat next is the biggest and best thing in the world. When your toddler screams and hits you after you tell them no, excuse the shit out of my goddamn French, but did you just threaten me? I woke up tired a few years ago and I've never really recovered since. Good God, some of these tweets are so old. Well now, looks like I don't need to leave the bathroom for the rest of the week. Guard Dog ignores staged robber during training exercise in Thai Jewel Store. You got a husky as a guard dog? Reasons I enjoy life. I don't, there is no joke, I am unhappy. Not having a girlfriend, not having a forklift, unloading by hand, oh, okay. There should be an antidepressant that makes you feel all the time the way you do for the two minutes after taking an urgent pee. Andy, I can see why you've been Conan's sidekick all these years. Millennials every day. I want to die. Millennials when a virus hits. Hmm, so they were lying, weren't they? Look, we've all got a preference of how we want to die. Usually it's just never waking up after we go to bed, not drowning in a hospital room somewhere. Oh, this is where you've been. It's been like a week. Could not be me. Where were you on the night of February 25th? Well, I bailed on my friend last minute and stayed home all alone. I was gonna cook a healthy dinner, but I ended up ordering a pizza and ate way too much. And I spent the rest of the night aimlessly surfing the web and hating myself. At some point, I even started to cry. Please stop. Oh, well, let's take it all the way down. Why did I do that? My wife and I have taken four photos together in the last two years. Meanwhile, we have 93 photos of our dog sleeping since last week. I mean, you're kind of obligated to take photos of your pet, constantly. This is the prime of my life. I'm young, hot, and full of depression. Okay. A year ago, this was our last normal week and nobody knew it. Yeah, I took a trip a year ago with a bunch of friends. Little did we know, it may have been the last one we got to take for years to come. Me muted on Zoom, but still doing the most with my expressions to show that I'm listening. You gotta try somehow, right? I used to suffer from depression, but through hard work, persistence, and never giving up, I now suffer from anxiety and depression. Same, Gavin. <laughs> Ain't that a peach? Your sad alcoholic name is your first name plus your last name. Huh. Oh, oh. How long does someone have to be dead before it's considered archaeology instead of grave robbing. As an archaeologist, I find this a very awkward question. Answer the question, grave robber. Come outside. No, I'll give you vitamin D. Ugh. And serotonin. Okay, fine. Haha, <laughs> enjoy skin cancer, bitch. You, bitch.
Doctor. Rappers are lucky as hell being born with names like Lil Uzi and Gucci Mane. Shake my head. My parents named me Brandon. I think you've got more than you're giving yourself credit for here, Brandon. Now this is the freaking crap that would qualify this year as the future. I've tried these and it's all fun and games until you take a sip and then get deep throated by a four inch ice rod. Just saying. I don't really see a problem with that. I see it as good practice, personally, but maybe that's just me. I don't think the Academy should honor a film with such controversial elements. Oscar voters weigh in on Joker. Best Picture two years ago was about a woman f***ing a fish. You should never take the Hollywood Elite Award seriously in any way, shape, or form, and that includes everything but the Tonys, I'd say. Looking at you, Grammys. Looking at you, Emmys. Looking at you, Oscars. Although out of all of them, I'd say the Razzies are the best. Y'all ever had that experience where you've been hungry all day and your stomach just says, screw it, I don't even want it anymore? Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's currently what I'm banking on to lose weight. Hey, what's up? Can you help me solve this? Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, I see. Didn't, didn't quite work out like you wanted, did it? Come with me. I'm here to kidnap you. Nobody ever invited me back to their place before. Screw attractive people. I mean, yeah, that's kind of the plan. Me thinking, hmm, now I need something sweet after I just ate. Yeah, it's my fat ass. My mom making me come say hi to somebody I knew as a baby. Why the hell would you do that? They don't remember me either. I mean, my mom's held a gun to my back for many reasons, but that was the dumbest one. My sleep paralysis demon waiting for me to stop looking at memes and fall asleep. God dang, always on that phone. And on that glorious note, we've come to the end of another video, ladies and gents. But before we get going, let's take a look at today's fan art, huh? Robin loves seeds, MK fan art. I love seeds? Well, I prefer nuts, but I think we can go with this for now. Look how cute I am. Always remember, if you even somewhat enjoyed this video, consider dropping a like down below. And if you really enjoyed it, well, then think about getting yourself subscribed and clicking that bell icon. And hey, if you're feeling super generous, why not check out my links in the description down below? And until next time, I'll catch you later.